Welcome to Faith Life Ministries International, the home of miracles. Total Gospel to Total.
Verse 2, praise the Lord. My help cometh from the Lord, which made heaven and earth. Look at verse 3. We're going down to verse 5. He will not suffer my foot to be moved. He that keepeth me will not slumber. That will be your portion this year. Except the Lord keeps you, you might not survive the year 2021. My prayer for you, all of you listening to me today, the second day of January 2021, may the Lord keep you because only what God keeps is truly kept. May the hand of God keep you. May the hand of God keep your children this year. May the hand of God protect you. As you have entered into the new year in celebration, may by the mercies of God, you journey through this year if Jesus tarry and see the end of this year celebrating God. May God not allow you to slumber, not to the agents of the devil, not to your enemies, not to the wicked. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Verse 4. Hallelujah. Glory be to Jesus. Behold, he that keepeth Israel shall neither sleep nor slumber. And look at verse 5. Glory be to Jesus Christ. The Lord is my keeper. That is your word for 2021. Receive it wherever you are listening to me in the name of Jesus. When God is your helper, he's your keeper. When God is giving you divine help, he is automatically responsible for keeping you. That is my prayer for you, for the works of your hands, for your business, for your family, in the name of Jesus. The Lord is thy shield upon thy right hand. And look at verse 6. Hallelujah. The sun shall not smite thee this day, shall not smite thee by day, nor the moon by night. And verse 7. Glory be to Jesus. The Lord, hallelujah, shall preserve thee in 2021 from all evil. Say amen, somebody. The Lord shall preserve thee in 2021 from all evil. He shall preserve thy soul from sickness, from any form of pandemic, from any form of evil arrows or challenges in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And verse 8 says, Blessed be the name of the Lord. The Lord shall preserve that going out this year. This is our covenant scripture, Psalm 121, verse 1 to 8. I'd like you to make it your daily meditation, child of God. The Lord shall preserve thy going out this year and thy coming in from this time forth and even forevermore. Say amen, you listening to me. This will be your portion in the year 2021. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, the Son of God. Brethren, this is our first day of fasting. We are fasting, remember, for 12 days from the second, which is today of January, to the 13th of January. Each day represents each month of the year, prophetically as instructed us by the Almighty God. So today represents the month of January, which prophetically we have titled our month of thanksgiving. So for the next 12 days, we're going to be doing this. I want you to guide the Lord your loins and ensure that you finish this fasting. Do not allow the devil to stop you. Don't allow anything distract you. It's very important. How you start the year is very important. It will determine how you will finish the year. And there is no better way to start the year than to start the year with God. Remember the Bible says, seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness and all these things shall be added unto you. When you start the year with God by the mercies of God, he will help you finish the year by grace in Jesus' mighty name. So I commend you to God and to the word of his grace. Continue, please, in the zeal by which you have started this fasting today till the end of the fasting on the 13th. And by God's grace, commonize the year under the influence and the control of the grace and the word of God in your favor. And watch God do a lot for you in Jesus' mighty name. The Spirit of the Lord told me, every year, like you all know, is program is pregnant with good and with bad. Every year is programmed with blessings and with causes, with favor and misfortune. 
all sorts of things happen every year. My prayer for you as we fast and pray that the evil in this year is minus from your journey, is minus from the life of your children, is minus from the works of your hands. In the name of Jesus Christ, that only the good of this year by God's grace will come to you in the name of Jesus. Still, that does not excuse you and I from the challenges that will come this year. Child of God, there might be challenges, there might be winds of trials that will blow, the wind of the COVID-19 is still blowing, but I am assuring you, just as God has prophetically given us a word for 2021, you will journey through with the help of God. God will help you do things that you can't do for yourself. God will give you supernatural help to accomplish things that naturally you can accomplish. God will help you keep your health. God will help you prosper. God will help you grow in your ministry. God will help you prosper in your career. God will help your children fulfilling purpose. God will help them fulfill their purpose. God will help them accomplish that which is their desire for the year 2021 in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, the Son of God. Let's look at the book of Psalm chapter 65 and verse 11. Thou grantest the year with thy goodness. I decree this. I make bold to decree this for you and your children and your family. Thou crownest the year with thy goodness and thy path drop fatness. May every part of this year drop you fatness. In spite of the challenges, in spite of the chaos that will be for the year 2021, may God crown the year for you with goodness. May you end this year in goodness. In the name of Jesus Christ, the Son of God, I pray for you, child of God. I'm making all of this declaration because today is our day one and I need to make this to open the fasting. I pray for you, child of God. You will not die this year. In the name of Jesus Christ, may your hands not bury any of your loved ones this year. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, the Son of God, i like you to say amen. May the mouth you are using to say amen, you will not use it to cry this year. In the name of Jesus Christ, may any tears that shall come out of your eyes this year be the tears of joy. In spite, please take note of the words, I'm using, in spite of the challenges or the trials that will be for the year 2021, may Jehovah God divinely help you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God. Lift your hand and shout three amen. Amen, amen, amen in the name of Jesus. I want to share briefly with us on this day one that your days of wandering around is over. I pray for you in the name of Jesus. If you have been wandering around years past, 2021, God will help you. You will stop wandering around in the name of Jesus. You shall not wander around financially this year. You shall not wander around spiritually this year. You shall not wander around materially this year. In spite of the challenges and the chaos that shall be for this year, may the hand of God help you not to wander this year in the name of Jesus Christ. Now look at our major text for this day, the book of Genesis chapter 37 verse 14 to 17. God will send you helpers that will guide you to the right place in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Listen to this very carefully. This is the story of Joseph when he went out to look for his brethren to give them food. And where he thought his brethren were, when he got there, they have left that place. Joseph didn't have any idea of where they have moved to. He kept wandering in the wilderness, in the bush, until God sent him an helper who by divine appointment was able to tell Joseph where to find his brothers. I pray in the name of Jesus Christ that this year you will not be wandering, wandering around. See what the Lord told me. He said, many of us, what we are set out to do for the day that should have taken us six weeks is taking us six years. Many of you, there are things that you have desired to have accomplished that should have taken you one month. It has taken you 10 years. I pray in the name of Jesus, your days of wandering around is over. 
in spite of the challenges that will be for us god will grant you speed god will send you helpers that will help you and direct you to the right place to meet what you are looking for in the name of jesus christ verse 14 and he said to him go i pray thee see whether it be well with thy brethren the father was saying to joseph and well and well with the flocks and bring me word again so he sent him out of the valley of hebron and he came to shechem look at verse 15 and a certain man found him and behold he was wandering in the field the father sent to him said to him go your brethren are in this particular place go and check their well-being make sure they are well and bring back me word and tell me how they are doing and how the flocks were but when he got there his brothers were not there so he was wandering around but thank god god sent him a man many of you are like this what you are set out to accomplish you have set out to do that you thought you have figured it out only to discover you had no idea of how to get it done and you have been wandering and wandering and wandering around 2021 may god send you divine help say amen child of god and a certain man found him this year they will find you help us will find you god will send people that will find you this year people that will help you in the midst of your wandering state in the midst of your challenge situation in the midst of the difficult times that you might face of be god will send you helpers in the name of jesus christ and a certain man found him and behold he was wandering in the field and the man asked him saying what seekest thou this year may god send people that will be interested in your matter say amen child of god may god send people that will take interest in what is bothering you you might not need to even go to them to say hey look i am lost please help me out no god will send people that will see you and they will take interest in what is going on with your business in government in authority in power may that be your portion in jesus name in business in your finances in your career may that be your portion in the name of the lord jesus christ the son of god the man asks him what are you looking for get ready somebody by the end of this 12 days fasting expect that phone call expect that email that we say to you what have you been looking for may god grant you that kind of help not by power not by mind but by his spirit hallelujah verse 16 glory to god we're going to 17 verse 16 and he said i seek my brethren tell me i pray thee where they feed their flock where i thought they were they are not there where i thought they would be they were not there this year in the name of jesus may jehovah god by divine help orchestrate your steps may you find yourself at the right place at the right time what about if joseph was not in the right place he would have lost in the wilderness in that bush going around and around looking for his brethren but god orchestrated his step he was at the right place at the right time and this man met him at the right place if he was not there at the right place he wouldn't have seen this man wouldn't have seen him and he wouldn't have gotten help verse 17 glory be to jesus and the man said this is my message to you today and the man said they are departed hands they were here yes joseph they were here your father told you to come pick word from him for him to see if they are well he knew where they were but by the time joseph got there they have left they have departed that place by the time he got there they were not there if not for this helper how will he have known where they had gone to this year that is the kind of help god will give to you in the name of jesus he said they are departed for i heard them say Ivadu Shegila Angradia. god is wonderful divine help is going to come from you this day for i heard them say let us go to Dontan." and joseph went after his brethren and found them in daughter glory be to jesus he found them whatever you are looking for in this year 2021 you will find it in the name of jesus by divine connection 
May God guide your step, the right place, the right time. May God send you help us. You will find whatever you are looking for. In spite of whatever our year will be confronted with, I decree you will go through the storm this year. You will go through the challenges this year. The winds of pestilence that we blow, the earthquake, the trials, the persecution. In the name of Jesus, the Son of God, if he tarries our Lord and Savior, you will go through it and you will find what you are looking for in the name of Jesus Christ. And found them in Dotan. You will find your own Dotan this year. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, the Son of of the living God. Just as Joseph located his brethren in Dotan, you will locate whatever you are looking for this year. God will send you that helper that you need this year by divine intervention. Lift up your hand, child of God, and say in the name of Jesus, whatever I am looking for and I'm believing God for, the year 2021 by divine help i receive it now in the name of jesus christ la sukra nika liko shika dina angra dina bahandia by divine help i receive it now in the mighty name of jesus christ the son of god lift your two hands up to heaven say lord my god let my helpers locate me this year in the name of Jesus Christ, handa likrodisho nina angra dile bahandia. Just as this helper located Joseph, I say I heard them say, God will send people that will tell you I know what the answer to what you are looking for is. In the name of Jesus Christ, receive that supernatural assistance. In the name of Jesus Christ, the Son of the Living God. Number three, lift your right hand and say, 2021. I refuse to wander around. I refuse to wander around. I shall fulfill purpose this year. In, the, in spite of all the challenges that will be for the year 2021. I want you to begin to pray that prayer. 2021, I refuse to wander around. I shall fulfill purpose this year. In spite of all the challenges that we face this year. Clap your hands and pray in the name of Jesus. Brethren, what we are doing is we are preparing ourselves that in spite of the challenges, the trial, the chaos that shall be for the year 2021, we will not end up as wanderers. God will help us in the midst of this year to find fulfillment in the name of Jesus Christ. Say in the name of Jesus, my father my helper this year let me be in the right place and at the right time decree and declare that decree and declare it father my god my helper this year 2021 let me be at the right place and at the right time by divine help oh god nika zandondea le kukusha adadeli brenia musa bilia le kandalu sepina nante tete keliba i receive divine help in the name of Jesus Christ, the son of the living God. If you are listening to me and you've not given your life to Jesus, ask Jesus into your life as your Lord and your personal savior. If you are sick in any part of your body, lay your hands where the sickness is. In the name that is above every name, I curse and I rebuke that sickness. You are healed and you are made whole in the name of Jesus. Remember every day for the rest of for, for these 12 days, every day for these 12 days, we are taking the communion. So after prayers, bless that bread, bless that juice, and take it as the body and as the blood of Jesus Christ. In thanksgiving, for this year, you shall enjoy divine help. God will keep you. God will protect you. Day two tomorrow, we are praying for the month of February. Please get prepared go to the church facebook you see our prayer points there from morning section you begin to pray them and god will continue to strengthen you in the name of jesus christ you are blessed see you tomorrow in jesus name